I knew that posture was not the right way to talk about the body. So I taught an alignment based model that was much more biomechanically based where we were thinking, you know, you think about the body in terms of levers and pulleys and you look at a skeleton and you and you say, okay, are you stacking your parts up? But, you know, you look at a skeleton and it looks like bones are touching each other and they're not ever touching each other. And so I, I shifted to using a tensegrity model the more I learned about um, biotensegrity and I studied fascia and biotensegrity and it's very hard for people to conceptualize. I'm holding a, a dowel and rubber band structure that this represents the body because that looks like a body and this looks nothing like a body. But these bones, the, the dowels are like our bones and they're held through a series of compression and tension in the body. And so when you, you know, do something like roll the bottom of your foot, you affect up the chain. So you can have an easily, more easily produced voice because of fascia connecting everything by rolling the bottom of your feet. So I'm still seeking a middle ground. It's a workshop that I've thought about putting together. I was sort of talking about beyond alignment because I realized, well, that model doesn't really work. Like I forget who said it, but some really sage person said all models are wrong, but some are kind of right. 